Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Anna Jolene and I'm the author of the Glorium Sea series, the Moonrise Beach series, and the new Heartbreaker series. So I do have a new planner that I purchased from Oristel. They had like a spring sale or something like that. And so um, there was a new size, well not actually a new size, I have been in this size before, but um, I haven't been using it since, oh gosh, maybe four years ago. So um, yeah, I decided that I want to go back into personal size. So um, I decided to pick up a personal rings planner from Oristel. Um, you guys know that I love the Oristel um, ring bound planners. I have them in A5 wide, personal wide, B6, um, pocket, A6. All of the sizes that she does, I pretty much have um, a few on hand so that I can switch them in and out. Um, but I actually don't have any Orstel planner covers that are in like the true personal size because like I said, I haven't used this size in quite a while. Um, but um, I want to um, switch up my health planner. I've been using a pocket TN and the moleskins, but I find it just too small for me. I have some health things going on at the moment. And I remember that I was in a personal size ring bound planner when I was really good at health tracking. So because I want to get back into that habit, I thought that I would pick up a new planner um, so that I would feel a little motivated to be in that planner and to write in that planner and hopefully I will get back on track with all my healthy habits. So um, let me show you which one I picked up. So it comes in this really pretty pink dust bag. I only got one planner this time. Usually I get a couple but um, I wanted to test out the Chloe's because this is actually my very first Chloe planner. You guys know that I have um, a pretty large collection of Oristels. The cloud planners are definitely my top favorites, but I also really like the Blossoms. Um, their airy covers like these are also some of my favorites. Those are for like bookbound um, planners, but um, this is my first Chloe. Um, so the Chloe has a more minimalistic design. Um, so that's why I wanted to give it a shot and see if this would be a good health planner for me. So this is the one that I decided on picking up. This color is called the English Rose and actually I do have one of the clutches in this leather already. So I had purchased this along with my cloud tote in the rose quartz. Um, it came in like a whole bundle with the twillies and other things like that. So this was one of the accessories that I chose for it. And yeah, this is kind of why I decided to go for the English rose. The clutch has gold hardware, same like the planner, and actually um, it has quite large pebbling to it. So it's very similar to my um, classic brown airy cover in the A5 size. So um, I decided to go for this leather or vegan leather for the Chloe. They do have some other like croco pink colors um, that I may try out if I end up liking this one, but I thought that I would go more safe with just a uh, neutral pink. I say neutral because in the planner community, I feel like pink goes with everything. So that's why I say neutral. So that's why I chose this color. So you can see that with the Chloe design, you have this um, strap that kind of tapers slightly there. It doesn't have any gold hardware on it. Um, I kind of wish that she did this clover or flower design like the little clutch, but um, I think she was trying to go for a more minimal look. And then on this strap too, um, it's one of the adjustable ones. So you have three slots here, which you can adjust the strap length so that if your planner gets chunky, you can um, move it out. So that's really nice. So that's one of the things I really like about her planners. And then you have two elastic pen loops. Um, one is slightly larger than the other. So you can use one for like your pen and maybe like a highlighter or something. In terms of the pocket configuration, it's pretty simple. You actually just have these four pockets, which I like. I prefer like a pocket like this as opposed to like one of the slits 
you know how sometimes she does that. I prefer pockets like this. So you have the secretarial pocket here, you have another one here in the back, and then you have two side ones. Now, I gotta say, with these two side ones, I feel like it's hard to get things in and out of them because they are so close to these rings. And these rings, by the way, are Krauss rings. They are 30 millimeter, which is another reason why I wanted this planner. It's because um, a lot of my other planners have smaller rings, like 25, and that just doesn't work for me. I need 30 for sure. But um, because the rings are big, I feel like it's hard to get things in and out of here. So let me see, like for example, here is just one of the sticker kits in my shop, and I feel like it's really difficult to slide it in back there because the rings kind of block it. So like you can see, it doesn't even go in there. So I'm not sure how functional these side pockets will be in the long run, just because you know I can't even slide a single sheet of stickers in there. So maybe I'll just put um, some decorative paper there or something just to protect the leather a bit. Um, I do notice that these rings seem a little like more gold, like yellowy gold to me. Um, as you guys can see, like even on the clutch, this is more like a true like light gold, and this one is definitely more yellow. So uh, I'm not sure if that's the case for all of the Chloe planners with the gold rings, but yeah, this definitely feels more yellow gold compared to my other gold ring planners from Aura Stell. So another thing that I've noticed about this planner is that so far it does not lay flat. So if I hold it like this, you can see it is popping up there and that's just because of the spine. You can see that it's really bent there where the rings are. So um, I may need to train this um, and we'll see if it'll lay flatter for me. Maybe once I start to fill it in with my inserts, it will lay flat. Like I said, I have been in personal wide B6 sizes, even A6 sizes. So it's been a while since I've been in a more narrow planner. So it could be also because this is narrow, it doesn't um, weigh as much. So it doesn't lay as flat, if you guys know what I mean. So that is the new cover that I got from Oristel. I'm really excited about setting it up. Um, I do want to do a quick color comparison in case you guys are looking at the pink covers from Oristel. I have here my Airy. This is a, an A6 cover. And this is the Cake and Sprinkles. It's a Safiano leather. Um, so that is the color comparison. You can see this one is lighter. This one has like a more like almost yellowish undertone to it. So yeah, this one is definitely more cool tone. And then if you guys want to compare it to the Camellia, I have it in the A5 here. The Camellia looks like almost like a white on camera sometimes. It's like a very, very pale pink. So that is what that looks like. And I can show you a comparison like this. So yeah, that is just a little color comparison for you guys. I'm really excited for it because um, I have purchased some new um, dividers for this size and I'm going to be shopping my stash um, so that um, I can set this guy up. Like I said, I have used personal in, my, in the past, but it's been a very long time since I've been in this size. But for health tracking, I have a lot of inserts that I purchased from shops. So I want to use those inserts in here and um, I thought about using like an A6 size because that's currently what I'm using at the moment, but that particular shop is no longer open so I can't um, repurchase those health inserts uh, for the A6 size. I only have them available as the personal ring size so that's also another reason why I just picked up one of these to try out. So I'll let you know how I get along with the Chloe design. So we'll see how I end up liking this one. I will definitely be doing a setup video on my channel for it. So if you guys are interested in that, then definitely um, make sure that you are subscribed. I do have personal size printable inserts in my shop. So if you guys are looking for some inserts, 
uh, for your ring bound planners. I have a bunch of them in my shop and you guys can use the code SAVE10 to save 10% off. And um, I have them for other sizes, not just the personal size. But that is everything that I wanted to show you today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any questions, you can leave them down below. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.